Hello and welcome to the Poly Innovator channel. This is the now page update for November. And to be honest, I didn't quite want to make this video today. I have had a pretty rough week and like a pretty rough night, even last night too. Finding out something happening to a friend of mine and then a lot of drama at the karaoke place after being there for so long. I still feel like I've been getting mistreated. And so it's just one of those things where it's been a rough week and today, uh, my mother's cat died, which was a pretty sad thing because it was a really good cat, really good animal. And I just found myself just like really not feeling up to doing this. And especially since I had also had a lot of meetings today as well. But I'm here. So personally, that's what's going on. And I'm still trying to find a job, which I guess gets kind of into the professional aspect. But that's really kind of it because I wanted to find work so I could move. I was hoping to be in Austin five years ago, let alone last month. I was really planning by the end of the summer to be ready to go. And I've been downsizing quite a bit. I've been even selling a lot of excess tech and stuff that I don't need. And hopefully I'll be able to sell enough to where it actually that can help towards getting my to my financial goal. And really it's about 5k that I want to save up. So I have a few months of rent taken care of and have enough to like get the gas and all the travel expenses as well. But I don't feel like I'm going to be able to get that done anytime soon because I need to have a full-time job and part-time job over the course of a month to get the amount of money I want, let alone maybe two months. And I wanted to avoid the winter like the plague because winter is coming and I can't stand it here. It's too cold, makes my bones ache. And I've been dealing with this since I was a teenager and I never liked it. Never liked the gray weather days, never liked the cold. And while I might sound really cranky today, I'm pretty jaded and I'm pretty like upset even if I don't always outwardly project it. And even last night, some of these freshman kids were like recording me when I was talking to someone outside of the karaoke place. And I told him to stop, and then he started getting in my face about being like, I don't know, just like, oh, why are you coming at me? He's like, I didn't. I literally just said, like, stop recording. I, that's not cool. And it's just like that kind of drama I just don't need. And so I found myself just kind of struggling this week. And today I had a really awesome chat with someone in Singapore today that was really nice. And having, like, uh, make a new connection like that, that's really cool. You know, to meet someone who's a creator and also is also a singer, too makes me really want to start doing more like music and singing content, maybe going America's Got Talent or something like that, just so I can get a chance to shine on the stage, if you will. So personally, I've been dealing with a lot of that negativity and trying to be positive despite that. I professionally need, like I said, income. I've been applying to jobs almost every day, and I'll either get no reply emails back or I'll get nothing back. So I haven't got an interview yet. And it's kind of weird considering a lot of the jobs, uh, pretty much most of the jobs I've applied for, I'm, I'm well uh, suitable for. And even the Halloween store, for whatever reason, despite the fact I worked there before and I did a good job there, I never heard back from them. I applied on October 5th and, you know, by the end of the month, I was like, oh, that's weird. I didn't hear from them. And so, yeah, I mean, to be honest, today's episode is kind of a little bit negative, but I don't really know what else to say. I guess what's coming up is kind of what I... Basically hinted towards before, like I'm gonna save up money so I can move. I've been downsizing enough to where I think I can probably fit everything in my car, and I mentioned that before. But like now I have even less stuff, and I'm even less attached to some of my stuff. I really do like my living room setup, but I'm also kind of partial to selling the TV and living room setup just so I could have enough money to move. Like I'm, I care more about the moving than I do about the materialistic things. Uh, I have my tech, and that's what that's what really matters, really. I even put up my secondary monitor for sale because like, at, at this point I don't need it, need it, and I can always get a different secondary monitor later on. And so really, I'm just trying to do whatever I can to get this done. And I am excited when it comes to content. I do have a lot of really cool content coming out. I finally got both of my first two channels uh, having a series going out consistently. So every week a video will come out. I need to kind of organize the shorts to be a little bit more consistent, but at the very least, there's one regular video going out every week. And so now I, can, I get to experiment with the interviews. I can do more of them. I get to experiment with live streaming, which has been kind of cool. I live streamed for the first time in a long time yesterday, I think it was. And that was kind of interesting, although I technically accidentally live streamed to the wrong uh, channel, but oh well. Um, yeah, and trying out these new tools. I'm like playing around with like Melt Studio, which is actually what I'm using to record right now, which is kind of nice. And I've been like talking to the team about it because I think it's an interesting tool. And I'm curious to see what I can do with it later on. All right, that's it. Thank you for listening. This is a now page update for November, so cheers.